And great to have the pleasure of your company wherever you're watching. We find ourselves here in West Yorkshire. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box for complete coverage is Lee Dixon. And we're on the cusp of bringing you live action from one of the most exciting leagues in Europe, the Championship. It's Huddersfield Town, and they face Burton Albion. Cheers, Derek. Yes, excited about this one. Interesting matchup for me. We should get a good game here, hopefully. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. Lee, what are you expecting from him? Well, we say to each other in the back four, don't give him a yard because he will score. Don't give this lad half a yard. He's such a great finisher. And so the initial 11 for Huddersfield Town. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. A 4-4-2, but with a diamond lead. Yeah, there's four players in midfield, but really only three. The two wide players will stay wide and help the full-backs. There's one just sitting in front of the back four, but the number 10, who's slightly advanced, he will provide the support for the strikers. Well, they get the ball once more. It looks promising. Can they forge ahead? And it goes! An early opening statement in this match. And look at the celebrations. Well, let's see that one again. It's all about the contact. Does everything right. He's not bothered where the goal is. He knows where it is. He gets a beautiful strike on it. One nil then. Lewis O'Brien and there to intervene he continues his run he might yet finish a glorious chance well it was never going to worry the keeper well no wonder he's looking a little bit sheepishly at his teammates head in a hand sort of moment O'Brien. So let's have a look at the table and the chances there for the visitors to go top if they can win. Yep, yeah, still early in the season, but it's always better to be at the. Surely the equaliser. Oh, he's missed it. Oh, goal behind Derek, and he's missed. It's a big miss. And a possession lost, intercepted. And a creative look about this. He's given a corner, they referee. And the short option preferred. That's a nice looking ball. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. Looks promising this. Well, body in the way. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Couldn't keep it. And room now out on the wing. What can he do from here? A very effective challenge put in. Well, the ball lost here.
And what can they do to stop him running? And in with a real chance. And a goal to level this contest. All even. Well, here's the replay. The timing of the run gets him behind the defenders. And because he's on his own, he collects himself and he finishes it perfectly past the keeper. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Can he put them in front? Pivotal moment defensively. And a tidy ball. Now let's see what they can do here. Opportunity it is. Just over the crossbar. And the decision offside here. Danny Ward. Lovely ball over the top. And he's waiting in the centre, unaccompanied. Well, that was simply miles off target. Dear me. Oh, close your eyes when you're watching this one. It's horrific. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. O'Brien. Oh, great vision. Well, they couldn't do anything positive with the cross. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Well, the attack looks promising. Crossing possibilities. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. That's not a bad ball, foiling them effectively. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Must take the lead here. That's a routine take. When you look at those stats, Derek, it tells a story all of its own. They haven't created enough chances the forwards have been off the game as well. They haven't really utilised the wide areas for me, but they should go on and win the game, to be honest. The timing was perfect. It had to be. And good pressure high up the pitch. And time for the change now. Toffolo. Life is never dull in the championship. Live action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Huddersfield Town taking on Stoke City. Yeah, game after game. The season is relentless, but players just love to play. Give them. And he's through here. Can he convert? And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, as we see from the replay, it's a classic pullback cross that sets up the chance. And the relaxed way he strikes that into the back of the net is pure quality. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. KK, please contact the nearest security guard. Thank you. Good technique displayed. A wonderful intervention.
Well, who would dare predict the outcome of matches in the championship? This is one to look forward to live on EA TV. It's Burton Albion. He's in behind. They had to react and did. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Chance to do damage. But well, the timing a little bit off. No mistake from the keeper. Will it be punished? No, not the best challenge. And he's in. And the keeper more than equal to it. Not a corner here. And that might boost their hopes. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can the players do theirs? They need an equaliser. So the corner played into the box. The end product just wasn't there. Played into the centre of the box. And the problem not completely solved. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Oh, in with a chance! Takes aim! And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day! It's superb scoring for him! Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back, and he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Jonathan Hogg. It's with Juninho Bakuna. Well read to put an end to that attack. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, not to be in terms of the counter-attack. Juninho Bakuna. Good use of advantage by the referee. Well, that'll be a free kick. We have entered the final minute of normal time. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Couldn't keep the ball. Grant. Richard. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on... I've just got a couple of questions about the match. Thanks very much for speaking. Cross with nuns and like the sin slot. Skin soft, curse all you want.